Greetings, Earthman, earthmansoil.com. God bless you, and thanks for watching this video. And you should, because this is going to be very helpful for you. We're going to talk about biochar today. And what I have here is uncharged biochar. It's plain biochar. And if you get any um, biochar, if you get any biochar that's uncharged, you cannot put that in your soil because it will have a negative effect and it will zap all your nutrients out of there and not be good for your plants so anytime you get plain biochar you need or make it you need to charge it and as you can see i got two different types of biochar i got a finer one okay and i got um a, 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 a coarser one okay so if you're watching this video you already know what biochar is it's charcoal that little piece of charcoal that has thousands of holes in it which nutrients moisture and microbes can uh, can be stored for later use of the plant's root system during uh, drought and um, other major, you know, things that can go wrong in your garden bed and soil, mainly drought. Okay, so you, when you get plain biochar, you gotta charge it, guys. And I'm about to show you how I charge mine really quick. What I'm gonna put in there is some liquid. Okay, in this liquid is my our our biostimulant, Kabloom which has a lot of great stuff in it. It has amino acid, fulvic acid, humic acid, tricontinol. It's got um, seaweed extracts, um, worm, um, worm juice, I guess you can say, a fancy worm juice that's been uh, fixed up really good. It's got Grovana in there, which is our IMO3 product, which is an amazing product, guys. It's an amazing inoculant, which does have a lot of our biostimulants in it, likewise. I'm also, like I said, I'm gonna put the, uh, and I also got in there some liquid Grovana too, which is really great stuff. Where if you order, you can make your own IMO3 products if you bubble it with a little molasses. Now, I, the nutrients I put in there, and I keep it simple, kelp meal, alfalfa meal, and azomite. Okay? That little pack right there is uh, yucca extract. All right, so I'm going to put that in there. And so I got about 50 pounds of biochar in there. I'm going to put probably um, a gallon of uh, Grovana and uh, probably I got about four, three gallons, maybe two, ga two and a half to three gallons of liquid here, which has our Kabloom liquid uh, biostimulant and Grovana uh, liquid. And, um, and I'll probably put like three cups of kelp meal or more, maybe three cups of alfalfa meal or more, maybe and then as am I, I'm probably gonna put four cups of that in there, okay? And so that'll be the nutrients that I need to charge my biochar. This will be the moisture I need to uh, incorporate it, all those products much easier. And this is the, and it's also got um, living organisms in there swimming around. And then this is our Grovana OS uh, IMO style um, inoculant with biostimulants. And I'm gonna put that in there too. And, I'm gonna put some compost in there, okay? And so it's gonna be about one third of this, of this, maybe a third or a little bit more, I'm gonna put of compost in there equal to that. And then, like I said, I'm gonna put uh, all these products in there. I gave you a number and how much I'm gonna use. And then, so I'm gonna put that in there. I'm gonna mix it up really good, okay? And um, then I'm gonna store it in some um, bins and then, uh, you know, I mean, every couple days I'm gonna turn it so it doesn't get stagnant or anything like that. And then um, it'll be ready in about two weeks, your biochar should be charged. So there's a lot of good ways of charging biochar. This is just one. Um, it's worked for me immensely, great, awesome, super, super. And I recommend it to you, but the only way you're gonna do that is you gotta go to our website, okay, and look at our products because they're for real and, um, I don't know. Do you want a successful garden? I mean, an organic garden? I mean, you got to have living soil. And you got to start somewhere. I recommend Earthman Soil for that. And not to mention all the biostimulants that you're going to get too. So, this is Earthman signing out. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them. Okay? And if, um, and if you know, like it, just push like, guys. And if you're not a subscriber, you should subscribe because there's so much more stuff coming towards you, okay? And you want to know when it comes, so and you'll be alerted and all that stuff. May God bless you, and I hope you have a great day. There you go.